Hello, everybody. We had to take a little break. It's been a busy week. But on those busy weeks, we wanted to remind everybody about what day is it? It's Sunday Soulscape. Sunday Soulscape. And what does Sunday Soulscape entail? It just entails getting out and doing something that fills up your soul. And for us, that means getting out in nature. In nature. And we are fortunate that our Soulscape has not had to venture too far away from home today, which is okay. It's not a bad thing. And we are here by the water and we are going to sit here for a little while and just listen to the ocean crash against the rock walls. Um, I'm going to go, because I can't sit still very long, <laughs> I'm going to go down there and look in some tide pools and hopefully find a starfish or a crab or something. If I do, you guys get to see it. We'll definitely get a video of But that. it's really important, we want to stress this every time we make these videos, especially our Sunday Soulscape, that you get out and do this. Because it's been a long week for us, has it not? Yes. A very long week, yes. right? And we needed a recharge. We were in big cities everywhere. And you, sometimes you just need a charge and feel that energy that I think only Mother Nature could actually mm -hmm. provide. Right? Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. And especially you Idaho folks, you know what to do. You just take your shoes off and put your feet in the river and enjoy. Yeah. Excuse me. Uh oh. Uh. <laughs> As he tumbles down the hill, it would be a painful tumble. Yeah. It would be a painful tumble. Look at this. If I went down, oh my gosh, oh, look at this. Really cool Karen, huh? But if I went down, oh no! But I'm gonna go down there right now. But I have my own path I'm gonna take. Thank you, love. Thank you. So he's off looking for tide pools. Can't quite get down to them because of all the seagrass. So he's looking for a new place to go down there. Meanwhile, I sit, relax. Watch the birds go by. We're pretty sure we saw an eagle catch a fish the other day. Ooh. So we are at McGuntacook Campground by the Sea. This is our home for the summer, well, through the whole season. Um, we are camp hosts. And this gorgeous view is ours, right in our backyard, basically. You're stuck? You fell? That's not good. Ow, oh, the rocks are really covered in seagrass today. <laughs> oh no. He always comes back with new scrapes and cuts. An important addition to your Sunday soulscapes. Make sure you're careful and you don't do anything that you're going to get hurt. Because, me being the smart genius that I am, tried to walk all the way down there and I don't know if Jesse got some videos to show you. It's very slick. And I fell down. After all my talks of not falling down. I'm a little bummed I missed the fall. You missed the fall? Yeah, that would have been a good addition to the video. <laughs> but I fell and I slid like a good 10 feet. So we need to... I'm still pretty... I'm very... Uh, what, how would we say this? I fall a lot. I'm accident prone. So I'm good at landing. And I'm good at making sure that I don't hurt myself too bad while falling. But very important on your Sunday Soulscape <laughs> that you do something that is not going to harm you, put you in danger, inflict any sort of pain. Unless you're me, who has a very curious soul and he needs to look and approach everything and find everything and 
I find myself to be kind of a, uh, a mountain goat, a billy goat, if you would. And I do enjoy rock hopping. And even in his flip flops. Yeah, even in my flip flops. I like rock hopping, but not in flip flops. See, I fell and I only got a tiny little scratch from everything and a bruised ego <laughs> and maybe a little bit of a hurt tailbone. <laughs> but that's okay. Just remember, folks, you be careful out there. Be safe. Yep, stay safe. Bye. Bye.